Marcus Conti reporting on the big outage. YouTube went down, you heard? For two hours? You didn't see that shit? Oh, my God, man. I got to fucking bit off all my nails, right? Waiting, waiting. What happened? No, no, please. Please, YouTube, please. Uh, so is it, um, so Zero Hedge is reporting it one way, right? So YouTube and uh, a lot of its assets, uh, apparently Facebook, uh, uh, who else? Uh, Instagram, Snapchat, Google Gmail, Google Cloud, uh, mysteriously went offline today about 2, 3 o'clock, right? And uh, it hit the East Coast the most, right? So now, is it ironic that on Friday at, at uh, midnight, Trump administration, the DOJ, declare that they're going to probe, do a probe on Google and uh, an anti-monopoly probe to see uh, if they may be broken up, if, uh, if they may start to impose regulation like uh, because they're over $100 billion market capitalization, that they can't act, uh, uh, act, no more acquisitions of companies because they're too big, right? Stuff like that, right? So, and then, pow, Google goes offline. Now, here's how Zero Hedge is reporting it, right? Trump declared, no, that's, that's the wrong one. That's Friday, right? So on Friday, Trump declares war on Silicon Valley. DOJ launches Google anti-monopoly probe. I, I reported on this yesterday, right? And um, today, did the government just test the internet kill switch? That's Zero Hedge reporting. I, I don't agree with that assessment. I think, why not? Isn't it, could it, couldn't it be Google saying, oh, yeah, you're going to squeeze our balls and then we're going we're gonna to shut down, the, we're going to shut the, throw the switch ourselves, right? A threat. It's like, you know, and see, you see how many people, people like uh, are disturbed by that, right? <clears throat> here's, here's one comment. Quote, I felt a great disturbance in the farce, as if millions of voices suddenly cried out in terror and were suddenly silenced. Ooh. Wow, internet warfare, right? So the U.S. is, you know, Trump is, now he's, he's, he's sanctioning everybody. Now they just sanctioned uh, India. Throw India on the pile. Now it's China, Mexico, and India. Uh, going crazy, right? It's going to totally sink the markets. Right? So if you have, if you're in markets, this is why it's going to go down. Now. Is this a good thing? I don't know. But that's not the point of the of the uh, of the of the point. The point of the point is that Google went down today, right? And we don't know why. It had, it's unprecedented. That has never, you know, two hours <clears throat> of getting the monkey every time you click on a page, right? So at 3 p.m., it appeared that Google Cloud affecting Gmail, YouTube, Snapchat, Instagram, and Facebook, among others, mysteriously and almost unprecedentedly went offline. <clears throat> right? A systematic network. So is it, so right away, who is it? Who's doing it? Is, did Google do it to themselves? Or did the government do a sabotage and say, oh, yeah, you want to play rough? You want to play rough? Or is it Google saying, oh, yeah, you want to play it off? We'll fucking take this shit down, man. Right? And it makes us all, it made me, you know, very aware of, like, I have Google. I mean, I have my, my email is Gmail, right? Google, my, you know, all of my videos are YouTube, right? All properties of Google, right? Very powerful, right? Is it, do we break them up and do they just, you know, piece of, peacefully go away? Or do they, you know, you know, burn the? Do they burn the? Uh, burn the field while they're retreating? Right? Are they going to burn the field down while they're retreating? Because it's going to get messy. Right? I mean, I think it's necessary. Right? So, Zero Hedge reported that uh, his his Google Cloud down, Google Compute Engine down, Gmail down, Google Drive down, Nest I don't know what that is down, YouTube down, Snapchat down, Uber. Down, next DNS down, Pokemon Go down, <clears throat> Google advertising up. <laughs> oh man! Um, so Google Cloud status dashboard. Uh, this page provides status information on the service that are part of Google Cloud performance platform. Check back here to view the current status of our services listed below. If you are experiencing an issue not listed here, please contact support. Blah, blah, blah. So, so Google put out a, a notice. We are experiencing a multi-regional issue with Google Compute Engine. 
I don't know what that is. We are investigating an issue with Google Compute Engine. We are having what appears to be a serious network outage. It's disturbing everything, including, unfortunately, the tooling we usually use to communicate across the company about outages. Ah, there are backup plans, of course. Here's a map of where it's hitting the hardest. There are backup plans, of course, but I wanted to at least come, to, come here to say, you're not crazy, nothing is lost to those concerned down thread, but there is a serious uh, packet loss at, at the least. <laughs> you'll, have, um, you'll have to wait for someone actually involved in the incident to say more. Google is a zero hedge making a, a joke. So far, no one has blamed Russia. <laughs> is that the next? Russia did it? Russia. Russia. Russia can turn off the, uh, you heard Rachel Maddow say, Russia can turn off the heat in the wintertime. <laughs> she said that on, on television. Remember she said that on her show. Russia. What if Russia just decides to turn off the heat? Turn off the power. Turn off the heat. So here's the map. So it hit my neck of the woods, right? That's where I am. I'm right in the middle of this big, this big red spot right here. I'm right in the middle of there, New York City. So it took out, seems like it took out mostly the East Coast. And it uh, looks like a little up here in Seattle, parts of California, and I guess a little yellow scattered around the country. So, so again, this is just, you know, this is, a, I guess, an East Coast isolated situation. But there's a lot of people that are here, right? it's, you know. Maybe 100 million people got hit by this. Parts of, it uh, looks like parts of UK, uh, right in France, the top part, probably Paris got knocked out. So, lessons about hosting, right? So, what's this? <laughs> ah, this is what happens. This is what it feels like when Google goes down. Ah, burning up, man. Fucking burning up. No, my fucking Google. No, my fucking God. No, I'm so fucking on fire, man. No, Google, please come back. Come back, fucking fucking. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Man, this is crazy, man. Google Cloud Services are down. Also, why Pokemon Go is down. Down. What's this one? Malfunction. 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 It's funny now, right? Because shit is back up. But it's not funny when it goes down. It makes you. It makes you crazy. It makes you crazy aware of how vulnerable we are to, and dependent we are on these forms of communication. That they are, in fact, the um, public square, right? <clears throat> so you know, it, it also occurs to me in in, um, in forms of in government. Sometimes you'll have what's declared martial law, right? It just occurred to me while I was sitting here, almost crying that YouTube took away my account personally. Uh, that's what you think. Like, it's a personal attack. And then, you, you know, you try to reach out to other people and say, oh, it's just a, everybody's hit. But martial law. So is Zero Hedge right? Is it martial law? Is the government, is it somebody high up because Trump decided to wage war on Silicon Valley and do a a uh, a anti um, you know a a probe into seeing if their monopoly is a breakup probe, right? Or is it is it Google striking back, saying, "Oh yeah, you're gonna probe us, Pr probe me, probe you," right? Which is it? I don't know, man. But nonetheless, the shit went down. And um, oh, what I want to say about ma martial law, right? So. So now that Google and Facebook and all these organizations that we rely on, all this uh, social media that we rely on, has become basically the public square, right? a form of communication within to ourselves. I put a video out, you, people comment, people comment on, I comment on somebody else's stuff, and we have this, this ongoing dialogue, or just Facebook, someone says something and then someone says something under it, right? And we have these... Um, it was super chat where people are, are communicating live. This is the new, um, you know, public square. And to have a corporation or even even the city, the, the government for that matter, in charge of our discussion, at, that we are at the whim that, that if, if these two people get into a piss fight, if the government decides that they want to piss fight with Google, 
we get we get uh, you know sewed down. We get we get mowed down, right? Just like and we get silenced, right? For two hours, you're sitting there, you, you're silent, right? You fucking you're silent, right? And is that a form of martial law? Isn't it isn't it the same if the government says, okay, nobody on the streets, right? Clear the streets, clear the clear the streets, right? Isn't this the new form of a martial law where? Yeah, I don't know, just an example, right? If the election isn't going their way and they need to get in there and rig those machines two, three hours a day before the, before the, big, the big announcement of who won the election, right? and suddenly everything goes down and all those competing voices go down, and then, and then what, right? Isn't it, isn't it a form of covert martial, martial law? What are you going to do about it? What are you going to do about it? What are you going to do, pick up the phone and call your friends? Do you have anybody's phone number? <laughs> I don't. You're gonna. How do you reach out to people? Your your whole network of communication is gone. So what I'm what I'm saying is it's a slippery slope. Right? It's a slippery slope uh, when you confront a organization like um, Google and say, okay, well we're gonna probe you and we're gonna squeeze you and we're going to. We think that you're a monopoly and we may decide to break you up. And they they just decide, well fuck you. We're gonna. Well, you you think you're gonna break us up? Watch this shit, man. Hold your fucking yo, hold yo. The guys in 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 they're like, yo, hold my beer. Watch this shit, man. Fucking they they throw the switch. Right? I don't know what it is, man. But either way, it's uh, Google's back up. Marcus Conti reporting, and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Well, we're still here. You know what I mean.